guys welcome back to the channel this is the third video covering our Croatia trip and in today's video we're going to be discussing the old town we will do a walk tour as well Dubrovnik is located in the Adriatic Sea in southern Croatia. In 1979, it was added to the UNESCO World Heritage Sites in recognition for its stunning medieval architecture. Its history dates back to the 7th century, which means the city has been around for at least 1300 years. The walls of Dubrovnik surround Old Town, which is the main tourist attraction of Dubrovnik. The length of the walls is about 2 kilometers, and in 2018, they hosted 1.3 million visitors. Fans of the hit TV show Game of Thrones would also know that Old Town in Dubrovnik also served as the location for King's Landing. And this masterful editing was done by Flow Pictures on YouTube and I will leave a link to his channel in the description. Here you can see that a combination of visual effects and the real world location was used to create something unique and fantastical. I highly recommend that you check out his channel using the links. Now that we have the history lesson out of the way, let's discover things to do in Old Town. When you enter Old Town, you are immediately transported back to the dark ages and the feeling is surreal. We had a great time exploring the narrow streets and soaking up the amazing medieval architecture. And we spent hours just roaming around. In Dubrovnik, we stayed in an area called Lapad, which is about five to seven minutes drive away from Old Town. And during our five day stay, four of those days we visited Old Town. That's how much we loved Old Town, the atmosphere, and all of the tourist attractions there. Apart from roaming around the city streets, you can also visit churches, palaces, museums. You can dine at cafes, bars, restaurants. And Old Town even has its own Michelin star restaurant, Proto, which dates back to 1886. Personally, we didn't dine there. We found it too expensive because you'll pay about 100 to 150 euros per meal. Don't fret, however, there are a number of restaurants and cafes that are reasonably priced, especially if you go away from the main street down those narrow alleyways. And since Old Town served as a backdrop of King's Landing in Game of Thrones, there's an insane number of souvenir shops dedicated to Game of Thrones merchandise. And if you're planning on buying Game of Thrones merchandise, it would be a good idea to shop around since many of the shops, especially those located on the main street, are pretty expensive. We actually found a small souvenir shop that had decently priced Game of Thrones souvenirs and merchandise, and it was located down one of the small, narrow passages. If you plan on visiting Old Town, I would highly recommend that you do the history and the Game of Thrones tour. It takes about one and a half hours. You'll discover the rich history of Dubrovnik, and you will visit some of the locations that was used as King's Landing in Game of Thrones. It's also worth mentioning that the City Walls Walk Tour is separate from the History and Game of Thrones Tour. You don't want to miss this part of the video because now we will experience the amazing sights and sounds of Old Town. If you found value in this video, please smash the like button and to support the channel, please subscribe. And this video will take you on a tour to the Dubrovnik cable car.